Yeah, it's just not quite as sharp, you know, some some mistakes, um, you know, a couple that turned into home runs, um, you know, still flashed his his good stuff and and gave us, you know, six innings, I think just allowing the three runs. So he was able to keep us in the game enough without necessarily his best stuff. Um, and we just, you know, had a hard time obviously mounting anything offensively tonight against Bailey. He did really seem to settle in after that leadoff shot in the fourth retiring nine of the next 10 that he faced. He was at 88 pitch mm -hmm. pitches. Would you have considered putting him back out there or is it a matter of him only throwing in relief the time before and not yeah. wanting to push? No, I was, we're, that was it um, after that six. Not not that he couldn't have thrown a few more pitches, but I felt like, um, you know, just being in and out and, and working pretty hard there, I felt like it was, it was, it was the time. Older and in relief in the seventh, gave a back-to-back -back signals to the bottom of the order there. Mm -hmm. You had Britain warming. What did you like about Holder facing the top of the order as opposed to Britain? Well, just <clears throat> trying to hold off on Britain for, for Mondesi and then um, Gordon, um, you know, in a situation where you're down runs, going to a significant uh, reliever in that spot where you're – potentially having to go one plus with those lefties coming um just felt like holder was the matchup to get us through the whit merrifield and then uh and then would have turned it over to Britt for a handful of hitters depending on on score in that inning and then going forward yeah to the right what was bailey doing to uh shut down your offense especially after the first inning when you got a couple hits yeah it, it seemed like his split was a problem for us you know we just we're having a hard time laying off that pitch out of the zone. Um, you know, when he's been good, that's a pitch that's really effective for him. Um, and, you know, he mixed in. He, he was keeping us honest with his fastball and, and able to throw strikes with his fastball. But but the split finger was a really good pitch for him, and, and we just had a hard time really mounting. We hit some balls hard against him. DJ hit a couple balls on the screws, Luke and uh, Aaron. But for the most part, he, he kept us pretty silent. Kenny. Aaron, understanding where we are in, in the schedule, is there any frustration? Uh, that tonight was your chance to get back up to 500 and just to kind of build on uh, the last couple nights uh, just to, to, to really get rolling here. Uh, well, I mean, anytime we, we come and, and lose and get shut down, it's always disappointing. It's always frustrating. So I, I don't necessarily look at it as you know where we are as as much as we're trying to get this thing rolling as best we can and and uh you know a lot of guys right now i feel like are contributing to the cause but tonight we just got shut down so it's frustrating anytime that happens